Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check your PayPal limits. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now let's open up the PayPal app here and go back home. Let's tap on wallet at the very bottom, right? Now, if you're on the app on your iPhone or Android, you can check it, or you can also just go to paypal.com if you're on a computer. Let's tap on PayPal debit card here at the very top. You'll be able to see I don't have a debit card currently, but if you tap on it, it will give you more information about your debit card, and in that screen, it will show you what your limits are. However, you can also just open up a couple of web pages. So if I tap on this, it will show on this PayPal help article what the send and receive limits are on PayPal. If you don't have a PayPal account, you can send a one-time payment of up to 4,000 US dollars. So keep in mind, this does change depending on which country you're in and which currency you're using. So in the United States, it's 4,000 US dollars. If you have a verified account, you can set up to 60,000 US dollars in a single transaction, but they might limit it to 10,000 for each transaction, depending on whether they think there are any red flags on that transaction or not. Now, keep in mind, if you haven't verified your account, then there will be a variety of different spending limits in terms of sending and receiving any large sums of funds. So you need to go through the process of verifying your account. If you open up PayPal, you'll see a little message there that says to verify. Now, if you have a PayPal debit card, you can also see the spending limits for that. So you can see for a PayPal debit card, you can have a daily spending of 3,000 US dollars, a daily ATM withdrawal of $400, and then over the counter withdrawal of $5,000. But on all of these, you can go in there and check them. As I said before, you can just go into your PayPal debit card here, and then you can manage those daily limits. And you can also reach out to PayPal themselves and ask to increase those PayPal limit if you have a long history of using your PayPal account and there aren't any red flags. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.